What's up, guys? We are back from vacation. Lewis, how was it, bro? Bro, amazing. Such a good time, guys. We ended up going to Epcot and Animal Kingdom, and it was a blast. We had a really good time, but we are back to reality now, which means we're back at Lewis's house, and we have to get the BMW put back together. So the charge pipe came in the mail while we were gone, yep. and Lewis is just cleaning up the intake manifold and stuff right now, so it's all clean when we put the uh, charge pipe back in there. And then that means we're going to be putting in the dual cone intake today as well, right? Dual cones are going in today as well. Super cool. So we're going to get everything put back together, not only as good as it was, but a little bit better, which is sick. And I'm stoked to see how the dual intake looks on the car. I think the grill and the little uh, carbon fiber wing for the trunk is still, still delayed. Still delayed. So we'll uh, make a video on that when it comes in. But for right now, we're going to finish cleaning up this manifold and then we'll show you guys the charge pipe. All right, boys, here is the new charge pipe. It is made by a company called BMS. Uh, it's aluminum, so when Lewis gives the car some boost, we're not gonna have to worry about this cracking any longer. And it's also in like this black wrinkle finish, and it looks really nice. So we're gonna get it thrown on the car here in a second. And if you guys are interested in one of these charge pipes for your BMW, we're gonna put a link in the description below and you guys can grab one for yourselves. Got the charge pipe back into place and all tightened up. Looks really good. The next step is going to be to put the intakes on. Merry Christmas. Oh yeah, baby. Noise. Very nice. Noise. This is the other one, guys. These things are sick. It's gonna look really good once it's all uh, put together the right way. Boom, now we're in. And that's a wrap, boys. We got the charge pipe back into the car and it looks sick and then we got the intakes upgraded. And I mean, you guys leave your opinions in the comments below, but I think that dual cone look looks absolutely Amazing, like, that looks so sick. Definitely something, like, unique. You don't really see this type of look too often in engine bays, so I think it looks really, really cool. And uh, everything went pretty smoothly for the most part. We are all finished up, and Lewis is just finishing putting away some tools. But uh, that's it, the BMW is the daily again and ready to get back on the road, and Lewis doesn't have to mess with it anymore or worry about blowing charge pipes up so i guess the next video for the bmw will probably be like the grills and the wing in the back right? wings, yeah. but uh yeah the next actual video on the channel is probably going to be with the fox body again i'm going to be putting the steering wheel and stuff on the fox so that's going to be exciting guys look out for that but uh that's going to be it for this one until next time guys remember to subscribe to the channel like this video if you enjoyed it and i'll see you in the next one be easy